Okay everybody, here's another scenario. You know, you're going down the bank like this. You're fishing all the way down the bank, casting to the shallows. You're seeing stuff on your 360 like that. There's obviously two big rocks just about to come underneath the boat now. Uh, you want to fish that, that type of thing. And you keep on going and you might keep heading off in this direction and not see anything. But if you look at your, at, at your chart, And now you zoom out. Can you see there's some really interesting stuff going on there? Let's take a screenshot of that. And what we're going to do now is we're going to follow that. Let's follow that bank out a bit and see what, what happens. What I'm, what I'm trying to emphasize here, these two things work together. They are fantastic tools to work together. One is a live radar type of deal which I think has tremendous value especially since I've got these settings and I've got this thing sorted out like this it's actually extremely easy guys um, it is my, my fault all along was actually a faulty uh, transducer and then I also had some bad advice unfortunately so watch out for slipway gurus um, uh, so yeah go and have a look at Brandon Palinik's video but but look at this now can you see how nice you can see that actual ledge there's that ledge there now what I'm trying to point out is can you see that ledge coming into play there I want to take a screenshot you would have normally been down there now you would have been fishing there you would have cast the hell out of that uh, tree over there and you'd be cruising down there somewhere now but look what's going on down here here's some interesting stuff look at this beautiful ledge here on this uh, 360 you take a screenshot and now we're gonna cruise down this bank here really really cool stuff Can you see this bridge coming up here? Let's take a screenshot of that bridge. I'll put all this in the video. And of course we've got sonar running. There's our 360 view. We should be coming up to the bridge now. This is going to be really interesting to see what sort of quality. I'm getting a little bit of uh, cross pinging that you can see there. That is coming from the 200 kilohertz. I just want to confirm if it is in fact coming from the 200 kilohertz. If we just go uh, more options. Stop sonar. That was already stopped. Let's put it back on. Back. Charts. Okay, there's the bridge. Can you see the bridge coming into play now? There it is there. And there's a fish. Now you see, now I don't have a rod in my hands. And that's my own fault. That would be a perfect situation. Man. Strange that we didn't see the fish here in this little water column. Guys, I can tell you now. This is how you want to do it. There's more fish. Okay, it's time to get the rod. Chat later.